beautiful day on the way to the airport super excited we were up bright and early this morning like 5 a.m so we we're on our way to the airport for our over two week holiday actually we're away for 17 nights to florida to orlando so we're super excited aren't we connor and our comfies every time i've traveled anywhere else i'm usually in like jeans oh god that's bright i'm usually in jeans but to be quite honest there's no point so we we're like we'll just go on track since and be nice and comfy bare face hair is back rocking the the knacker look <laughs> but comfort is key so we're about an hour away from the airport now we took our breakfast with us and um, i had baked oats in the car connor had some sandwiches we stopped for coffee but had a really pleasant drive to be quite honest so our flight is at quarter to two it is now just coming on half nine and we are booked into the lounge so i'm excited to get in there and just chill once we're through border security and everything but we're so lucky in dublin that we can do like pre-clearance and everything before we even get to america so we arrive in orlando and straight out and into an uber so 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 thankful for that started filming a pack with me video and it was going good you know getting all little bits organized before we were leaving but every single time i pack i just leave like i leave it till the last minute and then i get so flustered like you he knows all about it and this year i was like no i'm gonna be so organized i'm gonna get everything done but literally two full days and i was still getting flustered at the last minute when i had to leave like i don't know what's wrong with me is anybody else like that but it just seems to always happen so anyway that was a bit of a flop but we have the case all in the back there and uh, we both have two large ones and then a small carry-on and then little rucksacks to take with us to the airport so we're all ready to rock just waiting now to approach the car park we're leaving the car there for the 17 nights that we are away but i'm just so excited now and we were over in florida was it last year yeah a year and a half ago and like we've been a couple times before like he's been connor's been like throughout his whole childhood and it's just one of them places where i don't know it's just so different to any other holiday like you're like in, you're just in a different world and you're a complete child and it's just it's the best feeling ever so we cannot wait to get there and um, we got our tickets through attraction ticks so we have 14 day unlimited pass for all the universal and all the disney parks and um, that comes at like a set price so you get all the, the six disney parks and the three universal and there are some new rides and attractions to see so it's going to be very jam-packed it's definitely not a relaxing holiday by no means at all but we're so ready for it some dermaplaning on my skin so got rid of all like the peach fuzz and then got my eyebrows and everything done and also my nails so it's been a very pamperful week but um i just feel like whenever i do get the dermaplaning whenever i get the peach fuzz off my skin like drinks moisturizer like it's it gets quite dry so i've been literally reapplying moisturizer loads and i have a little pack in that i always take on a on a long haul flight anyway with like a toothbrush and moisturizer and just some cleansing wet wipes just to freshen up the skin because oh, in planes my skin gets so dry you know that tight feeling so i've got loads of moisturizer and i've literally topped up twice been in the car already but anyway excitement is high and we're almost there now so I will check in with you when we get into the lounge when we're done security and all that. almond flat white really nice and strong yeah. security and everything was an absolute dream yeah, yeah. like the, the airport is so quiet apologies if it's, it's kind of loud in here so it's kind of hard to hear but literally walk through everything there was no queues anywhere immigration was a complete walk through the guy at border security was so nice Look, he was like, was like 10 seconds to get past literally like just in and out it was great and also in the airport we didn't have to empty any of our bags. They have these new like high-tech machines and so you literally just put all your stuff. We didn't need to separate anything. Laptops, nothing. Kept everything in the bag. So, so handy. Like it was just the perfect, the perfect morning here. Yeah, so we came in, we had two plates of food. <laughs> we were in just as the breakfast was finishing. So we got some eggs and some tomatoes and we got hash browns and then lunch came out. So I just got some salad and now finishing off 
with my coffee and took some little protein balls from home that I made. That Connor made, but he copied my recipe. He just covered them in chocolate. Yeah. I drizzled so them. Oh yeah, so he's he's claiming now that these are his original idea. <laughs> But I booked this lounge online, so it was 41 euro per person, so 82 for the both of us. But you get all your foods, all, all your drink. Honestly, nice, it's so worth it. It is worth it, yeah, because you're not looking for seats. Like, it's so spacious and it's very chill. There's charging pods everywhere. And it's just nice to be able to, like, go up and see a nice selection of foods, like, buffet style. But um, you can get alcohol, but... I'm a little bit scared like I don't drink that much anyway but on Sunday night like a couple days ago we went out and I died of a hangover she all took the biscuit took the biscuit got a little bit too carried away and paid for it on Monday so <laughs> I am not looking at alcohol like I'll have a glass of wine obviously on holidays with dinner here and there but as of now coffee will do me Stocking up with some water. I don't know if I'm making this up, but I've seen somewhere that if you drink sparkling water, it kind of inhibits you getting pins and needles. And I always get pins and needles on a plane, so hopefully this will prevent it. Disney store over there, Universal here. Oh, I'm so excited! We have arrived! So excited! It's 10 o'clock, Connor's just checking us in over there. But oh my god, all the Halloween stuff over. Ashley is so excited to be back here. In the Bayliner Diner to get some food, all the drinks there. We must get a resort mug, Connor. How did they work again? It's um. But you get unlimited drinks in the hotel, isn't it? Unlimited drinks in the hotel. Does it say a price anywhere? Yes, but they will be really handy to have because we are here for twelve nights. Yeah. Pizza pasta there and international eats here. I go for some shrimp stir fry. Got our food. Connor got a chicken burger with fries and got the cup. How much was the cup, Connor? Sorry? How much was that? It was $19. $19, that's actually really good yeah. for the whole time. And I got a shrimp stir fry. It actually looks delicious and he made it fresh there. So he's way up to use his refillable to get a drink and we're gonna dig in. I'm a little bit delirious that we're actually here. Like I actually can't believe it. It's 11 o'clock now in Orlando and as of now, we're four hours behind Ireland. Yeah. I think it changes to five on Sunday. That's what the girl at the desk said. So what time is it at home then? 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 3 o'clock. And we just had like a big dinner. But we've I was- We've been up for 22 hours. We've been up for 22 hours. I'm st I was starving. So I was like, I cannot go to bed without eating. So we got our food, plates cleaned and we didn't even go to the room yet, we didn't even check in because the diner was closing at 11 so we were like, <laughs> we need to get food before it closes and the shutters have just gone down so we just made it but um, the lady at the desk was so lovely she gave us drinks, drinks vouchers so we get two free drinks of, of Starbucks or a cocktail or whatever we like it's lovely and also, show me because we told her it was our well, anniversary I, I, was I was just looking around and then I came back and she's like oh congratulations and I was like what did he say now he said it was our anniversary so she gave us little badges how cute is that she was so lovely so she gave us a map because um, the resort is absolutely ginormous like it's very big so we're way down in the beachside uh, tower and what she said we have a really good view so we're going to head down there now just walking down and look at the pool. Oh, I'm so excited. I could actually have a stroke. I can't wait. Our room was over there last year. So we're on the other side. We're in that big tower down there. Let's go. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I hate game rooms and he loves them. And there is one at the bottom of the entrance to the tower. So Connor's gonna be out of fortune on little silly games. 
the grand reveal. <gasps> Stop. No way. No way. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Look at that view. That is so cool. Come here quickly and look at this. Holy snickers. <laughs> How insane is that? Oh, oh my god! She was not lying. The flash is kind of sick. Oh my god! Like that is literally the whole water park right in front of the of the window. The whole thing. You can. Oh my god! You can see all the way around to Krakatau. Oh my gosh! Because last year we were on the we were on the other side and we only seen kind of a corner of the volcano, but this is just amazing. I cannot wait to wake up tomorrow morning and see that in broad daylight. Mm -hmm. Like it looks insane in the dark, but can you imagine first when it's like morning, first? Sunrise. Yeah, first thing in the morning. Oh, I'm so excited! But anyway, I'll show you the room now as a whole after I've cooled down after that little meltdown. <laughs> So we come in, it's actually quite a nice size room. It's quite big. Um, this is the little sink area, on its refillable cup. So it's nice and spacious. And then it's actually a walk-in shower we have. Any other time we've stayed here, it was um like a bath shower. So that's actually really big. It's actually huge, to be honest, really nice and spacious. And yeah, the toilet. And then there's like wardrobe hanging space in there. Got two big, king beds and tv and other storage i think there is a fridge yeah fridge in here so we plan to go to walmart tomorrow and get some snacks so we'll probably fill that up tomorrow and put other things in there roller coaster is going on the screen and there's a little coffee machine i've actually i don't think i've ever used this um any of the times i stayed here but we might but it's hard to kind of Go to that one there's a starbucks, starbucks downstairs. literally downstairs um and yeah just this is the cellar like it's just stunning the whole water park like that's the lazy river and like all the rides you just see everything the whole water park right there honest to god i just can't get over it i'm so excited to wake up mm -hmm. I'm just unpacking here and I got packing cubes for the first time for this trip and oh my god like look how perfect everything fits and I could just take out like I know where everything is so like swimsuits are in there underwear this is uh, toiletries makeup I don't know what's in there but there's something in there <laughs> that is very organized as well like so handy because I can just take them out and slip them where they are and everything's neat and organized and, ha and has a place and what I was gonna start doing is taking like things out and start hanging them up but there's no point I'll just take them out as I need them and just hang up dresses and things like that but everything's just gonna stay and it's in its little cube because then I know where it is and I it'll be so much easier then to pack up when I'm leaving because we are we're staying 12 nights here in the cabana and then we're doing five nights in the Grand Cypress and I was just thinking if I start unpacking everything and then having to pack again to move to a different hotel it'll be just so messy and so unorganized so yeah everything's definitely going to stay in its cube and then I could just take it out as I need everything is packed away we both had our showers Feels so nice and clean again. Clothes that we've been wearing, I'm just gonna wash them first thing tomorrow morning because it does get a little bit chilly here at night and they're cozy tracksuits. And if we wanna sit out doing s'mores or anything, it would be quite nice to wear them. So wash tomorrow morning. And then we are going to go for coffee and oh, there's just so much to do here. Like I actually can't wait to, to just see the whole hotel in daylight again and i think we're going to go to walmart and stock up on snacks and that tomorrow morning as well but yeah we've been up now for 23 hours so we are shattered i just popped two of my magnesiums and i took a painkiller because my head is splitting do you know when you're so overtired and you get that throb and headache and like it comes down into your ears and into your mouth oh it's so sore so Hopefully that um, neurofin will kick in and I'll be off to dreamland pretty soon. That is our travel day video. We hope you've enjoyed it. It's a bit all over the place. Travel days are kind of crazy. It's a long day. We're exhausted, but 
could not be happier to be here like oh my god i just can't describe the feeling of orlando it's just oh i don't know what it is but if you've been here you'll understand it's just so unreal so yeah we're delighted to be here and we're all unpacked and cannot wait to wake up tomorrow morning I said to Connor we should probably have a bit of a lie-in but no one else will probably be up like at 5 a.m <laughs> but we'll try to sleep till at least seven to get a good rest and enjoy the whole day tomorrow because we are also eating in the Hard Rock Cafe tomorrow night in City Walk. I'm so excited! So thank you so much for watching and definitely um, join us in the next videos. There's loads of vlogs coming and we just can't wait. So thanks for watching and see you soon!